This is Jason Spangler with Wagner Meters, and today I'd like to talk to you about a couple of the, the, the terms that I hear out in the field that are used, what I would say, inappropriately. Uh, the first two are actually used interchangeably, and they definitely don't mean the same thing. One of them is curing. Curing of the concrete definitely has nothing to do with, from the flooring installer's perspective, whether or not the floor is dry enough to accept a moisture resistant or a moisture uh, sensitive finished floor product. Um, a lot of times when you're talking to general contractors and or flooring installers, what you'll hear is you'll hear the term cured and dry as uh, being used interchangeably. And so keep that in mind when you're actually talking to the different trades because you may be thinking that you're talking the same thing, but you actually aren't. The other term that I use a lot, that I hear used a lot, is hydrostatic pressure. And really when it gets down to it, although it's not going to be a long, drawn out definition of this, hydrostatic pressure is something that happens very infrequently, and you actually have to have a water table that's actually above the concrete. When I think about it, and I think about hydrostatic pressure, and just pressure in general, I mean really, you'd have to have this kind of pressure to really blow the floor off. This is Jason Spangler with Wagner Meters. Good day.